What's going on guys? I've got a 2003 Lincoln Navigator and I'm going to use it to point out to you where you can find the location of the starter relay as well as two fuses for the operation of the starter. So to begin you're going to snatch this trim piece out the way. You may have noticed it actually says fuse right on there but kind of hard to see on these older cars. And uh, when you get this out you'll be greeted by the fuse box here. Now if you just try to grab this and snatch it out you may or may not have good luck with that. Uh, what I found is if you have a little flathead screwdriver there, you can stick it in the slot at the bottom and just angle it right up and out. It's going to come right out for you. Now, as far as the two fuses go for the starter, it's going to be these two 30 amp J-case fuses. They're kind of opposite each other down there at the bottom. So be sure to check both of those. Those are important for the operation of the starter relay and the starter solenoid as well. Now, the starter relay, it's going to be this one right here. You can just kind of pull that out. And you'll see with that removed, I can't start the vehicle. Won't crank. Now, uh, as a troubleshooting step, if you suspect that this relay is bad, uh, you can swap with the relay right beneath it. All of these are identical, but some of them are important. So uh, this one's not so important. It's for the, for the rear window defrost, I think. So you can throw that in there. And I'll go and get this installed. And uh, with that relay swap, Assuming that my other relay works, uh, the car will start right up. So yeah, that's about it. I hope this was helpful to you guys. Uh, let me know if you have any questions, or more importantly, any advice about troubleshooting the starter on your uh, Lincoln. And thanks for watching.